guys welcome back to my channel hope you guys are having a wonderful day today i have my vacation haul to share with you guys so as you guys might know i went to a beach vacation with my family so we were able to do a little bit of shopping so of course i like to share the items that i purchased with you guys some of these are items from like typical retailers like American Eagle. Some of these are beach shop little items that you can only get like at the beaches and things like that. So let's get into this little haul and I'll show you guys and I'll kind of tell you guys where I got them from as well. So just in case you were curious, maybe you wanted to purchase something similar to it. So the first thing I'm going to talk about is some little items I got from like little beach shops. So this is one of the items I picked up and I haven't worn it yet, but I'm so excited to wear it. I got it from a place called uh, actually I have no idea what it was called. It was just a little beach shop, but it's a beach cover up. So here's what the, the top part looks like. It's like a crochet material and then it's got these cute little flowers and then the sleeves to the little cover up are crochet as well. And then the bottom of the cover up has the crochet. I thought this was so cute and very summery. So I thought it'd be great for to throw over top of a bathing suit and just do a little bit of shopping and things like that. I haven't worn it yet. I actually got a good deal on it. It was supposed to be $46. I got it for $24. So I thought that was a fantastic deal for it. I'm so excited to wear this with my bathing suits that I love. I don't know about you guys, but when I go to the beach, I always pack so many clothes. And then when I get there, I'm like, why did I pack so much? Because all I want to do is put my bathing suit on and put a cover up on and you're good to go for the day until you go out to dinner or something like that. And if you don't go out to dinner, just stay in your bathing suit for the whole day. So I really like this one. I'm hoping that we get to go on one more vacation before the summer's over. That's my hope and that's our plan. So let's see what that happens. The next thing I picked up is a bathing suit actually from another beach shop. This is just the little top though because I have a ton of bottoms. I don't know about you guys, but I feel like if you have a couple bottoms that are like the basic colors, you can kind of mix and match. You don't have to buy bottoms each time, so sometimes I'll just buy a top. So this was just at a little beach shop. I got it in a larger size just because I thought it might be cute for days when, you know, like shark week happens and you want to cover your belly and things like that. So this is just a cute little top. And it was on sale for $10. bucks. i am like, how do you beat a $10 bathing suit top? It was supposed to be $20. It was on sale for $10. It has the little detail here, and then it opens up. I just thought this would be really cute, like I said, for Shark Week days, because that unfortunately does happen when you're on vacation sometimes. The next one is another bathing suit top that I picked up at a beach shop over in Ocracoke Island. I don't know if you guys are familiar with, like, the North Carolina area, but there's an island that you can take a ferry over to that's the Ocracoke Island, and I love going over there. My favorite place to eat when we go there is this place called... Oh my gosh, what's it called? Isn't that terrible? I eat there every year and I forget what it's called now. Um, oh my gosh, I can't think. Anyway, I'll, I'll insert it in the description bar or I'll put it in here somewhere. If I think of it during the video, I'll say it as well. But anyway, this is the Howard's Pub. That's it. That's the restaurant. I couldn't think. So here is what the little bathing suit top looks like. I love the detail to this one because this is like the front of the bathing suit top. So it has all this cute little detail to it and then the color to it just screams summer for me this was on sale as well I'm a bargain shopper you guys when it comes to clothing I hate paying full price so this was supposed to be $60 it was on sale for $25 and I thought that was a cute little bathing suit top to throw on with another bathing suit bottom like I said if you can mix and match them then the next things are some other items that I got from like little beach shops so I got some little shirts to wear and this one came from an actual restaurant that we like to go to it's just like a little hot dog stand we like going there because it's just kind of something that we started doing when our kids were very little and so we've gone there almost every year since then that we go to the beach so this one here is called Spanky's so here's what the shirt looks like it's the Spanky's grill it's just a pink shirt and on the back it's a little bit naughty so I'm not going to show you what he says so I'll just show you the back right here it just says Spanky's and it shows you that little monkey but it says a little bit of a naughty phrase so I'm not going to show that part and then the next one I got is a where did this one come from I'm trying to think oh we went to another restaurant on our way to the beach because we had to find places that were like dog friendly so they had to have like an outdoor restaurant area so we went to this place called the weeping radish so when we went there they were able to let max and molly like they had like this little sprinkler area for the dogs and then we were able to have them out there with us eating so i wanted a shirt from there and it says got beer which i don't drink beer i think beer tastes like nasty it tastes like horse pee so not that i tasted horse pee but it just has all their different beers and stuff they sell on there. And it's the Weeping Rider shirt. I like getting my t-shirts, like this time of shirts, like a little bit bigger. Because I think they just feel very comfortable, like if you're running around the house. And it's always nice to have like a little t-shirt from like a place that you went to on vacation. Because I think it just kind of takes you back to that time and makes you think of vacation again. So, got that one. The next one is, what is what is this one? Oh, this is just a regular little beach shirt. And it's for like an Outer Banks one. This says, Cruising for Cocktails, which... Hey, I'll take those. Maybe not beer, but I'll take some cocktails. And it's just got a little bicycle on the back, and it shows the little cruising for cocktails thing. 
I just thought it was cute. And again, I love t-shirts. Then I went to this place called, um, oh my gosh, the shirt has a hole in it. I just realized that's beautiful, Tiffany. Good job noticing that. So I have to have my mother-in-law fix that. She's a seamstress, which was no big deal because I got it in a really big size. So I'm not really worried about it. I got it just because I thought it was cute because it's got the red solo cups and I thought that was cute. But we got this at a place called, um, what is it called? It's the Jackie's Ridge area for you can go shopping there. So we got it there. I got it there. It was like very affordable. So I'm not super worried about the hole in it. I'll get my mother-in-law to fix it. No problem. But I just thought the red solo cups were really cute. So anyway, that's another little shirt. Then another one from a local beach shop is this one right here. And this one I've already worn because it's so comfortable. It's just a little shirt that says Outer Banks. It's a long sleeve shirt. You guys know me. I'm always cold. So I always look for things to kind of keep me warm. This one has a little bit of detail on the side where it kind of, I think it makes you look a little bit like it's like body forming or whatever. So it kind of gives you a little bit of a shape. And then also has a cute little hood on the back. So this one has been worn and washed. Love that cute little shirt. The next thing, uh, my husband got me some new flip flops because I don't know if you guys have told you before or not, but Max likes to eat all of my shoes. So I don't have very many flip flops anymore. So he got me these and I haven't worn them yet because honestly, I didn't want to wear them on the beach because these are that foamy type. And I know that they can kind of hold the water in. So I thought these would be great for here where we live and everything like that, but not around water. But these are just some Under Armour shoes and they're blue and orange. So of course I love anything blue and orange because my son goes to UVA. So the next thing is from American Eagle. So this is just a cute little sweatshirt. Again, I was cold at the beach and I didn't bring enough long sleeves. So this is just a long sleeve sweatshirt that kind of like um, ties up in the front here. It's just really cute. Nice, big and baggy. So I thought it was comfortable and cute. And I think this was like 20 bucks or something like that at American Eagle, which that's not bad for a sweatshirt. And then I went to a place called Talbot's. And Talbot's is a really, really beautiful, I forgot one dress. I got a blue dress too that has like ties on it, kind of like this shirt. It's just a plain blue dress, but I got that and I forgot to share it with you guys. So just know I did get a blue dress that went with these cute little shoes that I wore right here. I've already worn them. I wore this to our, we went out to dinner to Captain George's and I decided I would wear the little dress with the little ties with these cute shoes, which I know they're really long because I have a really big foot. So but these are just so comfortable and cute. So I thought they'd be great to go with just a very comfortable, casual little blue dress. And they were, they were great to wear with it. The next thing I picked up at Talbot's is a cute little skirt here. So here's what the skirt looks like. I thought this was so cute. Look at the skirt. I think I got it in a size six. Yeah, I got it in a six, but it says six petite, which I'm not petite by any means, but I felt like it was long enough that I don't feel like I'm going to be showing anything like that inappropriate or anything like that. So I got this little skirt here from Talbot's to go with. Let me show you the shirt that I got to go along with it. Uh, let me find it. Got shirts here hanging for to show you guys. Okay, so there's a cute little, just a plain shirt to wear with it. Just a plain little white shirt. I just thought that one might be cute, especially with the little blue shoes as well. So this is my one little outfit that I'm going to be wearing this summer because I think it looks very summery. The next thing I got from American Eagle is the shirt right here. I think this is so cute. Look at this shirt, guys. Like, it's got so much of the eyelet detail. And then the back has, like, the, uh, what is that called? Like, lacing. And then the front has, like, the closure here where it kind of looks like you're corseted up. But it's a very loose flowing shirt. I just thought this was really cute. And I got it in a size medium. And it was, like, $34, but it was on sale, too, that day. And I don't remember what the price was. But I remember it was not very expensive or anything. So, I love cute flowy little shirts for the summer. So that's another shirt I picked up. This is probably one of my favorite shirts I picked up to be honest with you, just because of how cute it is. So it looks very plain Jane in the front. It's just a blue and white striped shirt from Nautica. Uh, I got it in a size medium, but the back to it is so darn cute. The back makes me like so happy. So the back is like this. It's got the lace detail here so you can cinch it in. And then at the bottom, it's got these cute little eyelet detail with a blue and white striped shirt underneath of it. Isn't that so cute. I don't know why, but this just reminds me of being a little girl for some reason. I don't know what it is about it. Probably because my mom dressed me very girly when I was little. So that's what it just reminds me of. It reminds me of something very girly and cute. Then at American Eagle, I also picked up this shirt right here because I just thought it might be cute and comfortable for the summer. It's very, very soft. It almost feels like silk-like. I love the way it feels. So I thought this would be nice to wear, nice and cool for the summer. Then two more shirts for you guys. And then we're done with clothes. Uh, one more shirt I picked up over in Oka Croak is this cute little shirt right here. It's like a little, um, what is it? Like a, not a tube top, but a belly top, I guess. But I'm going to put like a tank top underneath of it because I don't show my belly off. 
but I think this would just be really cute and it's got this cute little tie in the back I just thought it was adorable perfect for summer so I picked that one up and then the last shirt I picked up is this one right here and this came from uh, Kitty Hawk Kites so this one right here is another one that looks very plain Jane in the front. You're like, okay, it's just a plain little gray shirt. And then you flip it to the back and it's got this cute little detail in the back where the detailing here and then with the lace underneath. And that's all completely see-through. So you're going to be able to see through that completely. I love little shirts like this where they're kind of like, kind of simple in the front. I mean, yeah, simple in the front and then like party in the back type of shirts. I love shirts like that. They're just really cute. Then the other thing that I picked up is a pair of earrings. I just got one simple pair of earrings at Talbot's because I thought, oh, I just dropped one. So I only have one to show you. So I got these because I thought they'd be really cute and simple to wear at the beach because these are just little pineapples. See how cute they are? Oh my gosh. I love cute little simple jewelry like that. So those I picked up. And then my son, my oldest son, picked up two things for me because he knows I do YouTube, of course. So the first thing he picked up for me, actually, this is not part of YouTube, but this is just something really cool. They have this place called Del Sol when you're at the beach and it's like color changing things that happen like when you take them out in the sunlight so like you can get shirts that will turn like they'll be white and then you take them outside and they'll change colors and or they'll get color to them. Then he picked up two nail polishes for me. So this one right here is the shade um, Thistle the Day Away which is cute. So the indoor color is this color right here and then when you go outside it'll look like that. So in the sunlight the color will change to this bright pink. Then the other color he picked up is this one right here and this one is called um silver skies so this one looks like that on the inside when you're inside of your house when you go outside it will turn this bright burgundy or not not bright but this burgundy color right here so again i just think they're really cool you can put them on your nails and they look very like very plain and simple inside you go outside and it's like whoa wham you got a whole different color on i just think that's cool now the thing he picked up for me for my youtube channel which is also the last thing i'm going to share with you guys it's something that I'm going to be using for Shop My Stash. I'm not going to be doing the monthly makeup drawer. I just, I know I keep changing my the way I'm doing it, but summer is hard for me to figure out what I want to do. So I think I'm going to do a weekly Shop My Stash. And in order to do that, he got this. Look at this cute little shopping cart. So we're going to use this for Shop My Stash. I'm going to put all my makeup in here that I'm going to be using. It's a cute little shopping cart. It's like so realistic. Like even this will close up and go in just like a real shopping cart. I'm like that is so adorable it was like 10 bucks at some kitchen store that he and my brother-in-law went into it's called kitchen collection i think this is so cute though so for shop my stash i'm going to be using my little shopping cart so let me know what do you think about the shopping cart honestly i feel like this is one of my favorite items i got from the beach this year just because it's so cute we did get an ornament as well but the ornament is upstairs and already put away so that way there i don't break it or anything like that before we put it on our tree it was just a plain simple little ornament we got one that looks like a little lawn chair with a little beach hat sitting on it so that is everything we got at the beach this year. I didn't get any makeup or anything like that just because honestly I wore makeup but very minimal makeup. I wasn't putting a lot of makeup on while we were there. It was just basically hanging out with family. If you'd like to know some stories about what we did at the beach and things like that, let me know. Or if you'd like to see a try on of anything, let me know. Thank you guys so much for watching and until next time, I'll catch you guys later. Mm -hmm.